African leaders meeting at the economic summit in Egypt have vowed to push for more trade and investment on the continent despite the growing threat of terrorism. More than 1,002 delegates, including some heads of state, were in talks to sign business agreements during the two-day summit aimed at attracting private sector investment. Analysts say despite an economic growth rate of more than 4%, Africa still accounts for only about 2% of global trade. You need to have uh, our own investors first, because when our own people invest, then the other investors have got confidence. Because if you don't invest, you take your money out, other people will say, oh, we don't have confidence. But people come because you're investing. Power and rail. Rail will unlock agriculture. Rail will do to Africa what it did to agriculture in Asia and even in America. Organizers hope the African 2016 conference can build on a 26-nation free trade pact signed last year.